the state owe the responsibility to settle disputes by peaceful means. The International Court of Justice, which is the principal judicial organ of the United Nations, plays an important role in the peaceful settlement of disputes. India supports the continuous existence of the topic peaceful settlement of disputes between states on the agenda of the Special Committee. India aligns with the statement delivered on behalf of the non-aligned movement. The following additional remarks are made in our national capacity. We thank the chairman of the Special Committee and the Bureau for their leadership in guiding the Special Committee meetings. The Special Committee is tasked with reviewing proposals concerning the United Nations Charter, particularly those focused on maintaining and strengthening international peace and security, fostering cooperation among nations and promoting international law and state relations. Given its responsibilities, the Special Committee's work is significantly important in interpreting the Charter's provisions to ensure their effective implementation. Therefore, we believe the work of the Special Committee is vital. We have taken note of the report a, Oblique 79, Oblique 33, of the Special Committee on the Work of its Annual Session in February 2024, wherein the Special Committee considered the questions referred to it in General Assembly Resolution A, RES 78111. We would like to make general remarks with a specific reference to the maintenance of international peace and security, impact and the implication of sanctions, peaceful settlement of disputes, and the overall thrust of relevant issues. Madam Chair, the Security Council, which acts on behalf of all the members, states, and the discharging its duty, has the primary responsibility for maintaining international peace and security. The impact of the application of sanctions is a significant issue for all. The Security Council, which mandates sanctions, has the nodal responsibility for finding solution to the problems of third states affected by the application of sanctions. Article 50 of the UN Charter confers right on third states confronted with special economic problems because of sanctions to consult the Security Council for solution and thus ob obliges the Security Council to find definite solution to the problem of the affected third states. Madam Chair, we are convinced that sanctions, when necessary and applied in accordance with the provisions of the Charter, could serve as an important tool for the maintenance of international peace and security. However, imposing sanctions should be the last resort and is strictly in conformity with the provisions of the Charter. The state owe the responsibility to settle disputes by peaceful means, which is a fundamental principle under paragraph 3 of Article 2 of the UN Charter. Article 33 of the Charter further strengthens its duty and provides the means which the parties to a dispute can choose freely. The International Court of Justice, which is the principal judicial organ of the United Nations, plays an important role in the peaceful settlement of disputes. India supports the continuous existence of the topic peaceful settlement of disputes between states on the agenda of the Special Committee. India commends all efforts of the Secretary General towards the continued publication and updating of the repertory of practice 
of the human organ and the repertory toys of the practice of the security council as they, these documents are very important source of reference i thank you very much madam chair